So I'm really excited to have over my first letter. Um, it's about how he's proud about being in uh, multiple choirs and when he was younger, during his Christmas holidays, he used to actually deliver letters for, for the house that I'm living in, the old post office. So what I'm going to do now is open up a couple of the other letters that have been posted and we'll see what's inside. So this is the second Len... Len... Len still. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is the second letter that I found in my post box. Let's see what's inside. Oh, that's very nice, very sweet. It's almost like a haiku, it's like a poem, a small poem. Thank you very much. <laughs> I can't do that. This letter's from Colin Anstey, uh, born in 1932, and there's a little little note on it that says, uh, hope you and the young man uh, can understand my writing. Uh, so let's see what's inside. Two small pages. Four butchers, woo. Oh, that's very sweet. At the end of the letter, it says there was no need to leave Ferndale, as there was all we wanted here. It's quite sweet, isn't it? This is the fourth response I've had, so let's have a look. Oh, well that's, that's a lovely letter. Um, they explain that back in like the war years, so World War II, there used to be quite a few mostly Welsh singing festivals uh, that were held in the local area and, and around where I live. And there's quite a few nice stories in there as well. So I've, I've also been given something else here, and this is an old newspaper article about a boxer who started off as, a, as an athlete, and at the late age of 30 he changed his profession to become a boxer and he became a champion straight away. I got given this by his daughter, I'm really honoured to, to have this as a story, um, and I've already started writing the song for this. So, the song's going to be called The Boxer. <laughs> okay. Such a man to fight his dying days Wonder if he can win this race Thanks to everyone who sent me letters so far. The responses I've had have been great. It really means a lot to me and I'll, I'll keep you posted as soon as more letters come through.